theme that Jackie's talked to me about, which is uh, having a tool library, which I think is a great idea. Oh, yeah. Apparently, it exists in places where you can borrow tools and and even like vacuum cleaners, refrigerators, or whatever, which is great. I wrote this before I found out about that, but it's in, in that spirit. It's based on something that I read in The New Yorker, so it's a true story. It's called The Transmigration of Tools. <laughs> he directed his next of kin to give away the tools, the sanders and mallets and scrapers, bit braces, chisels, and fluters, assembled lovingly over decades many impossible to come by nowadays, or custom made by himself for his work as a shaper of primordial elements, wood and stone and metal and bone. They threw a party when he died, the great tool divide, for that tight fraternity who spend their days molding and forging, soldering and finishing. His assistant brought a flatbed truck to haul away the welding station. Others crammed burlap saps burlap sacks and shopping carts with planes and brackets, spools of heavy twine, drills and drill bits, blocks of poplar, pots of glue. Soon the plywood boards stood bare. Only the stencils remained of hand saws and pliers and reamers, penciled ghosts of a life given to excavating the stubborn densities of matter. His works now scattered the universe he made, unmade. Yet it eased his dying mind to know his tools were one of a kind and would survive in other hands. Mm -hmm.